Hi and welcome to this tutorial. In this video we're going to have a look at how to create post relations between the post types and how to choose the type of the post relation you want to create for your post. So in order to access the settings for the post relations and set them, you need to go to Jet Engine Post Relations and here you're going to have this list of post relations if you have any existing ones. In order to create new post relation you need to go and click Add New and here in a new window you give it a name. And here you have to select the parent post type and the child post type. So I want to create this post relationship for two post types, authors and posts. So in my case, I want to link them to meaning that the authors have created the posts. So the authors post type will be the parent and the child post type, it will be post. So now choose the relation type three options here, one-to-one, one-to-many and many-to-many. -many. Let's have a look at them three one by one using an example. So one-to-one -one relation type. So let's say we have two post types, authors post type and the articles post type. In our case it was post. So let's say we want to link the authors post type and the articles post type. And one author has written only one article. And it means that one author will be linked to only one article that this particular author has written. So one author cannot be related to more than one article. So it cannot be two articles or one article cannot be written by more than one author. So I hope this is clear. So one specific post of the specific post type can be linked only to one specific post from another post type. So there is one-to-one -one connection. Next, one-to-many. Now let's imagine that one author has written more than one article but has written two, three or four or even more articles. One-to-many post relation allows you to link one post from the author's post type, meaning one author, to multiple posts from the articles post type, but it doesn't allow you to link the article from the articles post type to multiple authors. So one article in this case can only be linked to one author. So as you see here, this author is linked to two posts, this one is to two as well, but articles are only linked to one author. So each article can only be linked to one author. And the last one is many-to-many, -many, which allows you to link every single post from each of two post types to multiple posts from another post type. So in this case, each of the authors wrote multiple articles, but there are also cases that multiple authors have collaborated and created one article. So you see that now articles can have multiple authors. So this one has two of them and this author has three articles. So this author is linked to three articles. And this article is linked to two authors. So now we're back in the dashboard and here you choose what relation type you want to apply. Let's leave it as one to one. And here you choose whether or not you want to add a meta box to the parent page, meaning to the posts of the parent post type. In our case it is authors. And here you can also choose whether or not you want to add the meta box to the child post type. These meta boxes allow you to set the related posts for every single post in your post types. So I leave them both enabled and I click add relation. So this relation has been created and now if I go to authors, and here I go to an author and click edit. Here I'm going to see the related post box that allows me to set the related posts for this specific author. And let's just start typing in the title of the post. And here it goes. And we can just select it from the drop down list. And now we have set the related post. So this is how you add post relations. And this is how you choose the relations type using Jet Engine plugin for Elementor. 
I hope you found this tutorial useful. Thank you for watching.